Konnichiwa, watashi wa saki desu. Hello everybody, my name is Leon Minkui. For today's talk, we are going to be talking about an interesting topic called Japanese culture. So, let's learn a little bit about Japan itself. Japan is a very interesting country, which is also a very small one. Japan is also known as the land of the rising sun, and the country translates to sun origin. And so, from a Chinese perspective, they said that the sun rises from Japan, and Japan consists of more than 6,800 islands. There are four main islands that make up Japan are Honshu, Hokkaido, Kyushu, and Shishoku. Well, these four islands made up of about 47 lands per spectrum in Japan. More than 70% of Japan is mountains, and Mount Fuji is of the biggest mountain in Japan with more than 3,700 meters high. There are more than 150 earthquakes annually, make it, making it some of the some countries with the highest earthquake ratings ever. Japan has a population of around 106, 126 million people, which is less than half of the population of the United States. Yet, the area of Japan is just slightly larger than the area of California, a state in USA, which is very small. Japan has the third largest economy in the world, behind the United States and China. Japan also has the second highest life expectancy. Women's life expectancy is 87, while the men can expect to live until 80, which is something so high. Japanese is the official language of Japan. Japan has a prime minister and not a president, but Japan also has an emperor. Well, the, a little bit about the language of Japanese. Japanese has mainly four kinds of words. Romanized, which is something for people around, hiragana, katana, and lastly is kanji. Well, those are very interesting things that you could try to learn if you want to. Summer is quite hot in Japan, and there's rainy season that lasts about six weeks. From early to mid-summer, winter is especially cold in the north part of Honshu and Hokkaido. Well, one very interesting thing about Japan is its amazing cuisines. Well, if you look at Japan, you see there's so many different things, such as from different kinds of noodles like uh, udon, ramen, or foods such as nirigagi or uh, bento and a lot of sushi or sashimi. Also, mainly the Japanese cuisine is made up of five things, shashi, sushi, sho, and so it's actually a very interesting cuisine that you should try in your life. So that is all I want to talk about for today. Thank you so much for spending more than five weeks to help us to know about nine countries, also including this amazing country of the sun, Japan. I really hope that I could learn more up with this with you in the next session, maybe. And thank you so much, and I really appreciate your help to make up this community where we could learn and share more about the amazing cultures of different countries around the world. Goodbye and see you next time.